Good morning, everybody. How y'all doing? Happy Thursday. Sorry, it's Saturday. What's going on with y'all this weekend? That's cool. <laughs> I'm riveted. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm walking my dancer in the neighborhood. Anyway. It's like, you know, I haven't made a kind of a talky talk chit chat video. I might as well make one this morning. It's like at 7 o'clock. 6.57. To be exact. Let's go, Banjo. Let's go. It's a little bit misty out here. Anyway. So, I was thinking about it was like a video. Huh, Benjo? Uh, what are your thoughts about Kevin McCarthy? He's stepping down. Is he not going to be a representative anymore? He, he's not going to be the House Speaker. He's always going to fight for Americans, but he's stepping down as House Speaker. Benju! He's talking. I'm a little bit confused what's going on there. I haven't really looked into it too much. But, uh, it's okay. Tucker Carlson got fired from Fox News. Is that true? Is there, uh, so I need to look into that too. I thought I got fired. So I don't know if there's again some questions about that. I mean usually when you leave a place of employment that you built your entire career on it's because you got fired or you had a severe immediate, acute uh, differences of opinion amongst other possibilities, right? So, most recently, Kevin McCarthy. Really don't know what that's about. But The View thinks it's funny, his little speech he made. Some people on The View. Tucker Carlson got fired from talk, Fox and now has his Tucker Carlson show on X where he basically does the same thing except for 10 minutes less, right? Okay. And then in 2020, there's a lot of people running for president. Right, Tulsi Gabbard, right? 2019, 2020, can't run as a Republican. Need to run as Democrat. Why, I don't know. Other than uh, Trump was the main obvious political opponent. So, Tulsi Gabbard campaigns for two years and then graciously 
I use that term very loosely. Up to interpretation. Maybe even a little bit of sarcasm. Graciously leaves the race after campaigning, collecting, going around America, collecting, asking for money so she can campaign and spread her ideas on a national and dare I say international um, view, world view. And what are those ideas? A veteran, right? So, oh my gosh, a lot of people in the military commit suicide. Let's go, Benjo. I forget what other policy she had. Oh, no, war with Iran. That's right. was the platform. And I'd, ha I'd have to Google what other platform she had. It's certain. Was there. Was legalization marijuana? Hmm. But anyway, the point I'm trying to make, point I kind of wanted to make, question uh, to prompt further discussion, of course, excluding me, but you know what, I'm here in the neighborhood, and I guess that's all right for now. Huh, Benju? Well, I guess the truck had somewhere to go this morning. Hmm. Anyway, so I'm saying, think, I'm thinking, 2020, two years campaigning. I don't know before then, in recent history, and maybe not so recent history, where a presidential nominee has spent two years on the campaign trail. Of course, after 2020, it's been quite, it's, it's set a precedent, and it's quite the norm, right? And as far as staying active, it's a little different, right? Oh, somebody just drove through. Go in that way. So anyway, I just kind of wanted to bring up these concepts of Kevin McCarthy stepping down. I don't know, as representative, just a speaker, didn't look into it all that much, just all headlines. Um, Tucker Carlson. No, I'm, I'm tapping it again. Tucker Carlson. Leaves Fox, uh, starts his own new show on X, not Twitter, X. And before then, Tulsi Gabbard graciously quits Democratic presidential race. So Biden, another Democrat, can run. They just, and I guess the newspapers are getting delivered. Did you see this, Vince? It's not enough. So anyway, I just want to kind of bring that out and be like, what do you think's going on there? So Tulsi Gabbard quitting the race after two years of campaigning, going around asking for money in exchange for town halls, I guess, Speaking of fees, maybe another way to categorize that. How oh, many? And then, two years after that, boom, Tucker Carlson leaves Fox just like that. Year after that, boom, Kevin McCarthy, after fought for speaker for what, two weeks? Stepping down. What's going on? Who's 
the lesser of two evils here. Because I know if you watch the West Wing, they talk about that a lot. The lesser of two evils. And they, they say a lot of patriotic things about it. While they're saying they're tired of voting for the lesser of two evils. Dad used to watch that show. Tracy likes that show. <laughs> anyway. So I just kind of wanted to prompt a discussion of what do you think it is where all these people are getting jobs and then leaving them? Getting an income and then being like, uh, I quit. So, those are my uh, Saturday morning thoughts. Anyway, hope you'll have a good weekend. And we'll talk to you later. In the meantime, I'll be in the neighborhood. Um, unfortunately.